What's up everyone, this is Impact Easy, and welcome to another playthrough of Battle Brothers. We are back again, yes, for another playthrough, and this time we're going to be doing something a little bit more challenging and a little bit more fun. Fun or head-poundingly difficult, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. We're going to be playing as the Lone Lone Wolf, that's right. We're not going to be hiring any other brothers, it's just going to be our single Hedge Knight, and we're going to see how long we can survive. It was mentioned in the comments on the last playthrough we did with the peasant militia campaign we just finished and I found it really interesting I never really thought about doing a lone wolf campaign so thank you for that and we're going to be starting this up the main thing I'm going to be wor uh, considering with this playthrough is the hedge knight I'm not going to worry about the map that much I want decent traits I want to try and find a seed with a dec decent traits and uh, decent starting perks I have a few perks in mind that I want him to start off with so yeah the map's not going to matter that much it's mainly just the hedge knight I'm not, I'm not, I'm not starting a lone, lone wolf campaign with my hedge knight being dumb, clumsy, and club-footed or something like that, or, or blind. I, I don't know, blind wouldn't really matter, but yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna start off with at least a decent hedge knight. The map's not gonna matter so much. Also, I found this new flag they added. They must have added this pretty recently, because this was, I didn't see it in the peasant militia campaign, so, uh, yeah, it's nice that they're still adding content. I mean, it's just a flag, but it's still something nice. And where our company name is the Lone Lone Wolf. Random late game crisis if we make it that far. Everything on medium. And this probably won't be the seed we're using. I'll check it out and see how it is. But uh, also, if you guys enjoy this content, there is plenty more up on the channel. Just check that out. I got plenty of Battle Brothers and lots of other games up there. So if you enjoy this content, then uh, yeah, check out the channel and hopefully you'll find something else you'll enjoy. All right, let's start this up and see how we do. All right, we are here. It took a few rerolls, but we are in a situation where we have a pretty decent hedge knight. So the main perk that I was waiting for was Fearless. Fearless is a must-have when it comes to any sort of lone wolf playthrough, at least for me. I mean, if you don't have Fearless, you are in for a lot tougher of a time, especially with your morale checks. And if you get surrounded, it's pretty much finished. Fearless is going to save you in a lot of situations, especially in the early game. And strong, I mean, the extra 10 fatigue is going to be greatly appreciated, considering we're going to be using oh, we're going to be using this weapon's swing ability as much as possible. There's nothing like decapitating three brigand heads with one swipe. Being able to attack three people at once is a great ability, and I was kind of thinking about what I wanted his weapon mastery to be. I was kind of going with the hammer because it's so good against armor or the sword, so I'm still debating on which one I want him to have. We'll get we'll we'll figure that out when we get there. Also, we did get some decent rolls. So his high his high defense, which is what I was focusing on. I'd rather him have high defense. I was I was more focused on the defense than the attack because we can boost that attack uh, as he levels up. He's at sixty three, so it's not bad. Uh, his health is okay. His fatigue he actually rolled max on. Uh, if we take away the strong ability, he rolled a one ten, which is his max, which is great. And his resolve, if we take away, well, if we take away, what, 20? Because we have 20 here. So 44. So we rolled max on his resolve as well, which is awesome. I didn't even notice that. And yeah, his defense is high at 7. He could have, his max is 10. So, I mean, this is not a bad hedge knight. And this is what I was focusing on. I, I wanted the hedge knight to be half decent. I didn't want a hedge knight to start off with, like, dumb, clumsy, and club-footed or something like that. Or, like... The cocky, co oh, man, cocky is, I hate that perk. I don't know why. <laughs> I just do not like cocky. Uh, also, I haven't checked out the map too much. Uh, like, I don't know where the trade routes are. I don't know how many citadels, but I didn't focus on the map too much. I just wanted something that had like half decent cluster of uh, villages, which we kind of have down here. Otherwise, the, the hedge knight was my main focus. So we're going to start up here. Let's give him his equipment back before we head out into the wild. Also, perks, we're going to be going with Colossus, Student, and I was kind of thinking what I wanted the third perk to be. So, Fortified Mind is obviously something that we're going to want, but with Resolve, or sorry, with Fearless, I don't think we need to put this perk into him right away. So, it's either Brawny, and then I was also thinking, well, with a Lone Lone Wolf, we're going to be by ourselves, so we need to use Terrain as much as possible and it's not even the high ground that we need to use we need to find places where we can put our back up against the wall try and get as much obstacles around us so the enemy can't surround us 
and kind of take on as little enemies at once as possible. So that's that's going to be the main strategy of battle with the Hedge Knight, is trying to find terrain where we can funnel enemies in, or at least take away their numbers as much as possible. So Pathfinder is another great ability that we could that we're probably going to take. Um, but for now, I think I'm going to take the Brawny Perk, just for that minus 30 fatigue. We're wearing pretty heavy armor, so it's definitely something that we would want. And the more fatigue we can have is going to be the better, because the more times we're going to be able to use that swing ability. All right, let's put our perks in here. I was also thinking, so I have never had success with initiative. I've played playthroughs on my own where I would put I would be getting high rolls and I would be putting them all into initiative and I would get up to level six and that brother would still be going either mid battle or at the end of the turn initiative is such a troll trait to put your points in I don't know maybe somebody's had success out there I do not know I have never had success we have a four here I was thinking while well, we have a hedge knight it would be nice for him to be going first in battle because the last thing you want to do is have the enemy go first damage us and then us go I mean, you want your Hedge Knight trying to go in front of the enemy as much as possible, considering he's by himself, but it just, it never works out. You could be at level 8, putting every single, every time you level up, put points into it, and you would still be going mid-roll in battle. So, we're not doing that. It does not work. I, in, in my experience, it, it has never worked. Maybe somebody out there has, has got it to work, uh, be successful, but not me. Um, we do need resolve. We got a high high roll on resolve, but considering we're going to be using terrain to our advantage and trying to get our back up against obstacles, I don't think resolve is much of a priority as it otherwise would be. I'm not saying it's not important, but it, I think fatigue is what we want right now. That might bite me in the ass later. But how can we ignore these five rolls? I know he has three stars, but we're getting five rolls. So that is amazing. So we're already at 92. That's great. We'll be fine. <laughs> Trust me. All right, let's get into town. We're going to do our training hall veterans lessons. And now with that veterans lessons, we need to, f we need to make sure we're focusing on battles where those veterans lessons are going to be used to the we're going to get the most bang for our buck with that. We're not going to be fighting like three spiders or something. You know, it, that's just not worth it. Uh, also, we're not currently paying anyone, which is good. So we don't need to worry about wages so much. So our money should be rolling in once we get things rolling. Uh, food, we're using three provisions per day, which is nothing. And tools, obviously, we shouldn't have too much of an issue. The one thing I do notice with the Hedge Knight is that he doesn't repair very quickly. So we're going to have to get the blacksmith as soon as possible. Which shouldn't be too bad. And also dogs. I do not consider dogs brothers. So they're companions. At least in my mind. So we're going to be picking up a dog. Not right now because it's pretty expensive. We do have the bandage equipped. Yeah. Alright. Let's head out of here. So we have a citadel. There's nothing here for us. And I want to try and get down south as quick as possible. And try and get out of these barbarian areas. I do not... Uh, brigands is going to be my focus on attack. Or human. Any sort of human that isn't a barbarian. No, I don't want to find anything. I don't want to be spending time out in the wilds. Return. So this... This is going to be brigands. At least it should be. We're pretty far north, so it might actually be barbarians. We're going to find out. One thing I forgot to mention in the intro, I do have the same mods that I used in the Peasant Militia campaign, and I'll link those in the description as well. They're just quality of life mods. There's nothing um, perfect. And we're even in the woods as well. So this could not be better for us. And it's nighttime too. We're going to be focusing on attacking at night to take away the enemy's advantage of range. I don't know if they have any ranged units in this uh, composition, but uh, even if they, yeah, they don't. But anyway, we're going to be trying to fight in the woods as much as possible and at night. So let's back up. See, we got something right here. This is perfect. So now they only have two avenues of attack. This is really good for us. That's not good. I'm actually going to 
um, engage him. Boom. Yeah, see how we're going last in the turn? Oh man, you guys made a big mistake doing that. And yeah, we'll just go here. We're going to be focusing on club characters as well. We'll actually get a turn to rest, I think. Before they jump on us. What's my fatigue? I mean, I could go here and swing. Might actually fall back one. That's good for us. Good, we heard him. Oh, we missed our... Missed our shot. Um... 86, 86. He had less armor, so I figured I could kill him before. And that the cleaver's not going to do much to us. Alright. All that is is money. So that's a decent first battle. Just looking. We could pick up our sword mastery. I think that's what we're going to go for. Sword isn't too bad. It's not the worst against armor. I mean, it's half... It's, it's pretty good. And the swing attack. I mean, we're going to go with the sword. We made our decision. Okay, good. Our health is pretty good, so I don't think we need to worry about that. Let's head back into town. Quick 200 bucks. Secure last hopes rest. I, I don't know if that's zombies or not. You guys are heading north, so I don't want to do that. We want to be heading south. Do we need tools? No, we should be fine. We'll need tools next battle. They're pretty expensive here as well. Peat bricks. Which one? No, it wasn't that one. Which one was the secure? Find, no, I'd, oh, that, so find Last Hope's Rest, or secure Last Hope's Rest. All right, well, we're sec we'll secure it. I'd rather, I don't want to find it. I hate those finding missions. Ugh, it's going to be zombies, isn't it? Damn it. Well, zombies, I guess, are humans. <laughs> like, they're undead humans. I don't want to do this. I, oh my god. Okay. This is not what I... It's five of them, so it's not anything too crazy. Again, terrain, a terrain needs to be our friend. And I just found our spot. Which is good, because they're gaining on me pretty quickly. We might get a turn to rest as well. I could move up and attack. I mean, right here is not a great spot, but I would be able to do a swing. But we'd be taking away our terrain advantage. Yeah, we'll wait. Let them come to us. I can still do a, a split. I think. Or not. If I go here, it'll be better for us. For this round. Or not. Wasn't expecting <laughs> wasn't expecting them to jump that far. Alright. This is gonna be a painful round if they get lucky. Yeah, not bad. 
So he's fleeing and he's pretty much finished. Oh, we missed him. Uh, I think we can... Let's see who's going first. Yeah, we're going to run these guys down. We need all the XP we can. Yeah, we didn't get a level up on that. All right, we're going to need... We're going to need tools and they're a good price. All right, let's head south. Missing persons. It's probably spiders. Yeah, we're not taking that. All right, so let's do our first initial travel time. Which is going to be coming through the woods here. Yeah, there's more spiders. I do not want to fight these. All right, well, we don't have a choice. There is no choice with the spiders. You're already wavering. Just missed our 92 roll. That's the shit that's going to get us killed, is missing 90 rolls. That was not a fight I wanted, and it was such a waste of our training. Goddamn spiders. What is this? Yeah, towns. Definitely. All right, so we finally made it, and we made it now to our sort of compressed villages. So hopefully we can get some get the ball rolling a little bit here. Yeah, this is good for us. We are damaged. Yeah, we're a little bit damaged. We need to find another training hall is what we need. These guys are on fire. The ruins. Might have been these guys that raided them. So we got seven thieves. They're out in the open. We also got monster tracks happening around us. I don't know if I can get these guys to follow me. Doesn't look like it. Do they have any ranged units? No, it's just thugs. Okay, we'll head in. So this might be a decent spot because it, it does have... At least it has one tile that's not... Not available to them. We're stuck here now. So who is the, the main target? That's great. There's no... The only club here is you. Okay, so we have a fleeing. Do we have two fleeing? It's just him. And he's finished. I was going to say, that should be a level up. The fact that we can do our swing two times now is great. Lone Wolf. For, see, our resolve hasn't been an issue thus far. Having this would be nice. Which I think we're going to take. 
I mean, how could you not? We'll take that fatigue roll. We're not doing too bad. What do we need? We do need tools. And I can... Not that we can afford the blacksmith. But we can repair some things in our inventory. I need to find an armor, actually, before we do that. So we'll head down here. Looks like we've got some pretty decent-sized towns, so hopefully they have a training hall. Perfect. Yes, please. Cultists. Um, where's the... don't know if it matters, if the armor or the weaponsmith. Alright, so that should give us the option to buy the blacksmith. We're, we do not have enough money for it. Whoops. Or not. What do we need? Have items repaired at the town smith. It's because I did it at the armor. Did I... I just sold... Oh my god. I just sold them. I didn't actually uh, repair them. Is I think that's what I did. I didn't actually... Yeah, I just sold them. I didn't repair them. Okay. That was great. I've played this game before. Alright, <laughs> we're gonna head... Oh, yeah, that's a Citadel. They don't have any missions. What are you? You're not a Citadel, so let's head down here. Getting there before night time. Or not that it matters, I guess. Yep. We will take you. Looks like we got some fighting happening over here. Alright, so we're in the mountains. I think we're healed, are we? Yeah, they don't have any ranged units. Oh, we need the blacksmith so, so badly. Alright, we're repaired. Everything's good. Let's head in. We're not in the mountains. Excuse me. I would like to fight these guys in the mountains. Doesn't look like it's going to give me the option. Alright, being on a hill might be our best option here. Because I'm not seeing too much terrain. Oh, right here is actually going to be our best spot. We've got a hill with a obstacle. Come on, boys. Hit the line. Yeah, they don't want to. It's not surprising. So we got two tiles that they can't attack from. This first round's gonna be... Well, this attacking round's gonna be a pain. Oh, he is... We need Berserk. That is definitely our next perk. We need to be the ability to attack twice after a kill. We're on a hill with lone wolves. So we should be doing pretty good. Oh, man. There we go. Yeah, those... <laughs> Ooh, that was a delayed attack. Uh, we need to get rid of him, which is good, because he's fleeing. Jesus, they're like wearing me down here. Good. What a tough fight. No, we're going to return it. 
We need to keep the people happy. The town's happy. Alright, so we need a weapon smith, which we don't have one here. And we'll keep this stuff. Everything is really expensive. We need tools, though. Why are they so expensive? Not interested in that. Yeah, no, we're not interested in this either. Well, it's a... It's about a day's travel southwest. Where is it? Well, the only southwest option is... Where am I? Yeah, it's C. Yeah, we'll take it. I mean, we're going that way anyways. Path goes around the mountains. Perfect. Tools are still pricey. Give me some brigands. No, I don't want to. I don't want to find stuff. How are we doing for morale? We're content. Now we're just far away from everything. That's a citadel. I can't go there. We can go north. Is there an easy way to do that? Oh, there is. Nice. Kind of a... Desolate little town here. Hunt down what terrorizes. So it's probably... What could it be? It's probably not going to be spiders. It'll probably be nachos, I think. It could be undead. I... I really don't know. How much is it paying? 440. We'll accept it. Yeah, it's, not, yeah, it's a monster. Nine tools. So we need to be at full strength here. And spending 400 crowns on tools is absolutely crazy. So we're going to rest. Actually, we need to find who we're fighting first. Dire wolves. It's only three of them. Okay. That's fine. Prefer not to fight them in the water. I don't know what it would give me if I fought them in here. Yeah, we're still... Oh my god. <laughs> they just uh, rushed my ass. Um, Good. How many attacks did he get? I felt like he got a ton. One down. These two are fleeing. We're taking some serious damage right now. We gotta win this fight quickly. Their level up, which is what we want. No loot, which is always great. Goddamn dire wolves. Twenty-seven tools to prepare. Berserk. Yes. Definitely needed. We need to be killing these guys quicker. Another great fatigue roll. We could take a port somewhere. Could take it over here. We haven't been over on this side. So we're going to West... Westenstradad. Oh, they got a training hall as well. Do we need that? No, we still have one more battle? Yeah. Alright, tools. How much are you? A lot... You're still expensive. Uh, 
All right, we need to rest. Do we have injuries? I don't think we have an injury. Man, we need the blacksmith. All right, so I just sat there and rested up. Whoops, I don't want to cancel that. Um, we're not totally healed yet, but I don't want that mission to go away. So we're going to head over here. Do we need food? We got... I don't want to buy food right now because it's ambush trade routes. So we're going to rest here until nighttime. It'll give us a bit more time to heal. There's no ranged units, but we should be all right. Yeah, we spent about two days just repairing. We need the blacksmith really, really badly. Because sitting here wasting days is going to hurt us when we're trying to deal with tougher enemies. Luckily, these are just thugs. I'm going to be cutting out uh, a lot of the time wasting stuff on this series. It's because it seems to be a bit more like micromanagey when it comes to this playthrough. They got a dagger there. What do we got up here? This is where Pathfinder would be nice. See, I'd much rather go here. If I don't get caught. It's not a bad tile. We're locked in anyway, so we'll just take this. It'll take him a minute or two to get to us, which is give us a chance to do some damage. And we have Berserk now, which is great. Nice. Yeah, Berserk is... Now that we have Berserk, things are going to be a little bit more easy. Less challenging. No, I don't want to lose my high ground. You can come over to me. Thank you. Goodbye, Dagger. And goodbye... Goodbye, you too. Um, no, usually I would. I almost want him just to take his gear. So we'll get him to join us, which you're going to take his gear, and then we're going to uh, disband him. Although it doesn't look like he has much. More curious to see who he is. It's just a farmer. Yeah. All right, well, give me your clothes. And goodbye. And it doesn't matter because it's just me. <laughs> Come join us, strip down, and then get the hell out of here. <laughs> That's how we roll. And we need to get paid more for these missions. These are not, not great. That, that is expensive as well. We're going to take it though. I mean, it's plus 35% experience for each each uh, battle. Now, next, we're pr I don't even know what we're going to be taking next. Possibly Pathfinder. All right, let's head down here. We'll see what's going on. Nothing? What is... Preparing Feast. Interesting. All right, we're doing good on tools. We could head down south. Fight some nomads. Nomads are could be pretty tough, though. Speaking of nomads, they got slingers in here. Let's slow this down. Let's see if we can get them where... The desert's just going to be an open area. Yeah, they want to fight us. Let's get into the mountains. And we'll definitely fight these guys at night as well. If we can, they're going to catch us. Yeah, they caught us. All right, so we got stuck in the middle of a... Nice. Nice one on that. Uh, we're going to retreat out of this because we got screwed on our terrain and we got screwed on our, our time of day.
I want to fight these guys in the mountains at night. They have way too many mazes for us to be dealing with this without a terrain bonus. Yeah, it, it's like two milliseconds away from nighttime. Yeah. And I want to be in the mountains. So come on, get in here. Now oh, great. Now they got the... Oh, they're coming after me. There's nine of them. I like this. I don't mind this either. This is all three. So now they only have a, an attack of three. Can I get somewhere else that would be better? Actually here. They can only attack me from this one tile. I'm kind of up on a pedestal here. Yeah, they can only attack from this tile. That's an issue. Somebody else take a spot. Get out of here. Ooh, he hit his own guy. Don't kill him. I want that XP. Yeah, we definitely don't want to get dazed. Man, could you ask for a better spot? We just went from a wide open field to being attacked from one tile. That's what I mean with... We're going to have to play a little bit differently than what we're used to. Who's fleeing? You are? Can I get down on you? I can. You're not going anywhere, sir. Thank you for that. I will lose the high ground advantage for the fact of killing that guy. So they're fleeing. Are they? No, they're still throwing. Oh, okay. Oh, where are you going? There, caught him. So you're using the same tactics I did. Gotcha, fool. That was a good. That was a good battle for us. A lot of XP, a lot of uh, material. All right. What next? So this is going to take up one, two, two more perks, and then two more will be possibly Adrenaline and Pathfinder. We still haven't taken Fortified Mind. We haven't needed it, though. Our morale has been okay. I mean, Footwork would also be nice as well. These two perks are, like, a definite. I think we'll take... We'll take this. Because we know that's what we're going to be taking anyways. Yeah, we weren't even... That wasn't even a mission. That was just... That was just a flight of fancy, that battle. Anybody else want to get smashed? Um, armor. Yeah, let's heal this up. Or repair it. Okay.
Try not to spend too much money. Now that should be it. Was that five? All right, so we have the option for the blacksmith now. Still way too expensive for us, but I mean, once we sell this inventory, we should be all right. We're slowly gaining inventory. Very slowly. Drive off nomads, perfect. Yeah, I'm just starting to think that nomads might not... Whoa, these guys came out of nowhere. Um, I just got caught. It did pause, but then I hit spacebar. That was my fault. I'm just, I'm starting to think that fighting nomads might not be the best option, considering it's going to be hard to find terrain. Like, we're, we're fighting in flat open deserts. All right, so there is 12 of them. I am not, I am not liking any of this. Their weapons are pretty insane. They got a ton of maces in there. I'm, let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, that's just, that's, isn't a fight that I wanted to fight. I don't even know where to go. I don't know if it would be better to fight them over here. I don't think it will. I would like to just get them to leave me alone. Holy smokes. Get away from me. You guys want to follow me all the way to the mountains, I'll fight you there. Kind of wasting my time, though, with this mission. Let's see if we can find the same kind of train. Looks like something over here. Yeah, it's not exactly what I was looking for, but it's not bad. It's not the same as before, but they're going to have to come around and do a lot of travel time. And I can't throw sand in my eyes either, which is the Nomad's go-to weapon. Actually, right here would be better, would it? It's kind of the same odds. One, two. They can only attack me from two tiles here. They can attack me from two tiles here. And two tiles there. So we'll just stay. What? How are you still throwing sand at me? Get the hell out of here. You're in a mountain. What are you throwing? Rocks? throwing mountain sand in my eyes. Ooh, went for the sand and not the days. Now I have to make my way to these guys. I'm behind a hill. You can't hit me. Ugh. All right, so we're low terrain, but at least we caught him. Stop running. Oh, 
I'll take that terrain. More loot. Alright, we gotta be cautious because we know that there's more nomads. And we know that... Give me your valuables, fool. Okay, there- oh. These aren't the same nomads we fought before. But I'm starting to realize what a big mistake it was to come down into the desert. This wide open terrain is not doing anything for us. Fighting in wide open deserts. We're, we're going to finish up this mission and we're going to get the hell out of here. And I'm sick of getting caught by nomads. Will you leave me alone? Oh man, I am going to... I'm going to kill these guys. I'm just luring like... Infinite amount of nomad tribes into the mountains. Alright, we need to find... Oh, man, it's just nowhere to go. There's just nowhere to go in these deserts. It's just wide open desert. Yeah, right. These guys are hitting their 43s. No sand in the eye, which is nice. Beautiful. 95, 95. You're the weaker one, so let's take that attack. We just got rid of two maces. It's the maces that are the... I <laughs> just stun-locked us. Don't stun me. Goddamn asshole. So it's just one more. As long as these guys don't hit all of their attacks. He's fleeing. Alright, we shouldn't have anything to worry about. Good, we got a morale check here. Man. What a mistake it was to come down south. This is crazy. <laughs> Absolutely crazy. Forget it. I don't even... I don't even care. That we cancelled that. I just want to get the hell out of the south. Ooh, cheap tools. Do we, do we need more after all that fighting? No. Did we level up at least? No. Uh, we don't have veterans lessons, so we need that again. That was where? Up here? Yes. There's a road going out into the wild here. But it doesn't look like it leads anywhere. And we got a few missions. Yeah, no, we don't want that one. Three days north. We'll take this. Uh, yeah, we'll take it. Oh, it's right here. That's quick. What are we fighting? That's thugs. Uh, we're not healed for this. And I want to get rid of you. He's fleeing. Oh, he's coming back. Interesting. <laughs> he came back just to get slaughtered. Alright, that was... That's taken care of. 
I got lucky on that. Now what are we doing? Escort workers to the Herbless Grove. Back and forth. And we also got a level up now. We were talking about Pathfinder. We have one, two, three. We have four more perks, if my math adds up. We'll take Battle Forged. We'll take... We need Fortified Mind. We're going to be taking that on the next perk. We've got a decent roll on Resolve. I'll actually take that. Start worrying about resolve a little bit. Our fatigue is not too bad. And we have two more. Yes, two more battles. We're getting really good prices here. Chester's hat. What I need is the great sword. Get rid of this long sword. The dagger might have been nice, but I don't think it's really. I don't think we're gonna have the opportunity to start sticking people too much. Alright, have we been up here? I think we have. We haven't been to this place yet. Well, let's go say hello. Ambush trade routes. We will take that. And it looks like... Looks like a camp where we're going to have some raiders. It's still thugs. Thank God we're not spending any money on on uh, payroll. Because we're spending a lot of time just sitting here healing and repairing. Health is fine. We just need our... Our armor repaired. Alright, let's head in. Yeah, we're not perfect, but we're alright. What do we got going on over here? Not much. Need to make a decision quick here. Yeah, there's really nothing around. I'm going to take this spot. Do that. Got somebody fleeing already. Oh my god. I don't think I'm going to be able to catch up to him. Yeah, we'll just finish it. Is that really my whole stash? Just figs? Interesting. <laughs> we just had figs in my inventory. Yeah, no, we're not taking this. Two days northwest, no.
All right, so we haven't been up here yet. We haven't been to many of these these towns, this faction. We have been here. Okay, good. We haven't been over here or up this way. But the question is, do we want to? I think I'd rather just stick around this area. Let's get away from those guys. Two days east. We might want to take that. Yeah, this is something that I'm more interested in. Take you as my squire. Have you killed any anyone? What can you do? Have you... I mean, I can... Bring him on. And again, I'm just going to take his stuff and get rid of him. No, we're not going to pay his compensation. Thank you for the clothes, the fine clothes. Linen tunic. And we'll continue on. All right, so we have seven thieves. Again, I don't think I'm going to be able to get them into the forest. Necromancer, just fall back for a second. No, we're going to be in a wide open field. And we're going to have to rush the Necromancer. Well, this would be a decent starting position if we didn't have a Necromancer. Um, we're going to fall back. And we might get caught here. What I'm thinking about is doing a wide retreat. Now, there's no way they can catch up to me right now. See how they're they're almost moving in two two times per turn, the way they're they're waiting and then going. Yeah, see how they're slowly catching up? They're using their movement. See, I want to get away from these guys. And bring them on like... Bring them on a wide flank. We're kind of stuck here. I think we might have to fight this. This didn't really go as planned. <laughs> Nor does anything. Okay, so there is a tree up here. If we can take it. Man. Oh, thank God he missed that stun. I say we should be able to kill him. Are you really going to raise him up? You asshole. Well, we're totally surrounded. Okay, so we're fleeing. Nice, nice head chop. I mean, those bites will add up. We need to get rid of that next mace. Now I need to retreat out of here. Once these guys die... My god, he's just gonna keep raising them up. Is he fleeing? No, it's probably one of his bodyguards. Okay. Another head chop. That's good. Now these bites are starting to add up. This guy's 
another head chop. That's perfect. He's still fleeing. Who's he raising up? They're raising up people that I'm chopping their heads off, it seems like. Another head chop. I want to try and break out of here. Oh, he came, he came back. Well, you're dead. We got plus 25 damage for the next time. Now, yeah, right. Oh, let me out of here. I doubt if I can retreat. Headshot. Let me out of here. Chop these guys' goddamn heads off. We are so fatigued. Even and even if and when we get out of here, it's gonna take us a while just to get to. Oh, he's fleeing. Well, looks like we're gonna win by attrition here. Nice head chop on that. Okay, so he came back. There's only one zombie left. We just need to chop his damn head off. Not that that matters. We just moved one tile. Oh my god. Perfect. Oh, we're gonna run him down. Come here, you bastard. Where are you? Is he actually fleeing? No, he's there. Yeah, we're just... We're gonna wait for our fatigue to come back. Goddamn asshole. <laughs> we pretty much just won that by attrition. That was it. Alright. Enough is enough. We need Pathfinder. I'm starting to see this as an, an, a, an amazing perk to have for us right now. There's just no way around it. Um, we are getting Fortified Mind eventually. Probably. Alright, let's get back in here. We're going to collect our pay, and then we're going to end this episode. It's a bit of a long one. I wanted to have, you know, a decent first episode on this long, Lone Wolf, Lone Lone Wolf series. So, if you guys want to join me on the next episode, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to everyone later. Have a good day. Bye for now.